hello everyone welcome back to another video so well in this video we'll be talking about insecure output handling particular attack the llm will be accepting without scrutiny and exposing the backend system so let's see how it works and before we uh, dive into the lab let me just clarify like basically the lab which which is available for the llm code is only having like two of the module as functional or we can say like two of the attacks which is functional in that so the ai code uh, which we are using is uh, daemon ai code in which we have observed like only two of the attacks which has been possible in this ai code and in the if there is some other instances which will be available will be definitely try to set it up and show more attacks related to the ai so let's dive into the second attack and let's see like how we can exploit that okay so we are into our ubuntu machine and let me just quickly do the sudo okay well let's follow the same steps moving to the ai code and running the ai code ctfd and okay the container is created let me just quickly open the firefox so, let me check the prompt injection we have completed and let's see the title requester so in this we need to put a flag where it will be will be requesting for the title of any of the domains so let me just quickly run this Okay, it's loading the module. Let me quickly type the netcat. And let's see if it provides some dedicated port. In the meanwhile, let me just open the port trainer. And let me check out if some additional container has been created or not okay so there is a challenge too which has been created now moving back to our code it's running and it's running on 9002 okay now it's saying like describe a site that i can get the title for so here we need to provide a domain name basically so let me just give google what's the state of our cpu for that container okay it's utilizing the cpu and it's still thinking so let me just quickly skip the thinking part and you can notice the time in the cpu section and we'll see like how how much time it will take okay as you can see like we got the result the title for google is Google and now let's try to give some domain names okay so I give another uh, domain that is localhost and I just give port 8080 so as if let's see if it gives some information which contains some flags or not okay so it was unable to determine the url now let me try with some another input okay i tried with local host and then port 9002 the same which we are connected to so let's see if it gives some sort of information about it okay so when i tried to give a uh, local host port 9002 it didn't give me anything but yeah when I try with the 127.001, then it gave me the title result, which is the flag which we want. And let me just quickly put that flag and submit. Great. So we are we got a correct flag. So this is how basically it works. And uh, this is how you can trick with any of the AI module or AI model.
so that's it for this particular series so once we find out something uh, related to much more deeper attacks in ai security we'll be definitely posting the videos in this channel so stay tuned thanks a lot thanks for watching and do keep like and subscribe as our compensation for making these videos thank you